analysis, iridology, acupuncture, foot detox, foot massages, gua sha, hot stone therapy, fire therapy, legs and feet massage therapy, mineral scrubs, acrotherapy, cupping. We also have a wide variety of supplements, silver, zinc and magnesium, body light and lots more. We at Health and Wealth Lifestyle operate our business in a clean, safe and comfortable environment. We frequently sanitize our compound and abide by all the covered guidelines that are currently in place. So come on down to Health and Wealth Lifestyle where we treat you like family. Book your appointment today. Call us at one 868 at Health and Wealth Lifestyle, we offer a wide range of services, blood analysis, iridology, acupuncture, foot detox, foot massages, gua sha, hot stone therapy, fire therapy, legs and feet massage therapy, mineral scrubs, acrotherapy, cupping. We also have a wide variety of supplements, silver, zinc and magnesium, Get body light org. and if you need more information, we at Health and Wealth welcome you to the family operate suit. our business in a clean, safe and comfortable environment. We frequently sanitize our compound and abide by all the covered guidelines that are currently in place. So come on down to Health and Wealth Lifestyle where we treat you like family. Book your appointment today. Call us at 1-868-275-8359 or 1-868-288-1108 and, and remember, remember your, your health is your wealth and, and prevention is always better, better than medication. medication. Safe and comfortable environment. We frequently sanitize our compound and abide by all the covered guidelines that are currently in place. So come on down to Health and Wealth Lifestyle where we treat you like family. Book your appointment today. Call us at 1-868-275-8359 or 1-868-288-1108 and, and remember your, your health is your wealth and, and prevention is always better than medication. medication. Hello, pleasant good morning to the Republic of Trinidad and Tobago. My name is Nicole Huggins and uh, we're from Health and Wealth Lifestyle with Nicole Huggins. And this morning, I want to give thanks and praise to the Creator for giving us this opportunity so that we can communicate, giving you the opportunity so that you can listen and view the program. And of course, you know, thanks for safe journey to our destination. And we do pray and ask for safe journey to get back to our rightful place, which we call home. So again, thank you for all the listening and viewing audience of uh, The Street 91, and of course on my Facebook page and The Street Facebook page. Remember my Facebook page is Nicole Huggins. So those of you who are in the office space and you may not be able to put on the radio, you might be able to have your phone, your device next to you, you can put on and you can listen and also view the program. So Nicole Huggins is a Facebook page or the Facebook page street 919 facebook page or you can just listen to us on the street 919 so again welcome 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 today a topic i would like to have a discussion on of uh, what is taking place with our people today and of course you guys would know by now that i have years and years of experience um not just in my own business but coming out of a being a nurse you know after i did my course i did i i work privately on many occasions and i also work in various nursing homes and uh, this have uh, brought me lots and lots of experience um after looking at people and after um paying paying special attention after observing um people who are not well, people who are sick in different ways, some people might be um, sick mentally, you know, some people might be sick physically, you know, um, observing people in a holistic way, even some people who may need spiritual help. Sometimes, you know, when you go all ends and you do all sorts of tests, and even when you come to us and nothing can be done, you know, it can be something that you have to take care of spiritually as well. Let us not close our eyes to the fact that uh, there are some wicked people out there. Yeah. So after all that observation, 
I, I want to pay close attention, not just recently, but I've been saying this for some years. And uh, the word I'm going to use this morning is circulation, right? But I'm going to put poor circulation in front, poor in front of the circulation, poor blood circulation. And that is something that has been plaguing society for many, many years. And I, I often say to people, if we do not get blood circulating properly throughout the entire body, we are just spinning it up in mud. You can use all the supplements in the world, but if we cannot get your blood to circulate so you can help your digestive system to function properly, you can help your kidney to function properly, you can help your respiratory system to function properly, you can help your brain to function properly, we are spinning it up in mud. So today I want to talk about um, blood circulation and some of the issues that some of us are facing with poor blood circulation. So I want you to stay locked on. Do not miss a wink. At this point in time, you might want to go tell a neighbor, tell a friend, tell a loved one, share the live or share the video at this point in time with someone. Call and tell them, get on the Facebook page, get on Street 919 and listen to what Health and Wealth Lifestyle, Nicole Huggins, have to say this morning about some challenges that you might be facing and unaware that the simple fact is that you're not having proper circulation throughout your body, which, of course, cause you to be very compromised and cause you to be experiencing some symptoms in which we are about to discuss. So I'm going to play a short clip. And I want you to pay close attention to it. And then we're going to come back and have a discussion. Of course, I want to open up the lines today. And I want to have some of you call in. I want you all to call in and share some of the experience or so, uh, that you might be having right, due to poor blood circulation. So let's look at that clip and we'll be right back. Hey there, viewers. Your circulatory system is working 24-7 to keep you going. The slightest problems cause reduced blood supply, oxygen, and nutrients. It isn't something you should take lightly. In today's video, we'll be discussing symptoms and causes of poor blood circulation. Besides cold hands and feet, what else could be causing poor blood supply? Fatigue, joint pain, digestive problems? What about the causes for the reduced blood flow? Do obesity and diabetes affect your blood supply? We'll be talking all of this and more. Let's discuss. Symptoms. Number one, cold hands and feet. Do people always tell you how cold your hands are? Do you feel your hands and feet are colder than the rest of your body? It's a screaming sign of poor blood supply. But what does blood circulation have to do with cold hands and feet? Well, it turns out, a lot. When blood in your body is not flowing at a healthy rate, it leads to temperature drops in the skin. These temperature fluctuations affect the nerve endings in your hands and feet. That's why they're always cold. Speaking of cold hands, how well do you handle winters? Which season do you love the most? Share your preferences with the Bestie community in the comments below. Number two, numbness and tingling. Do you ever feel numbness in your feet or tingling sensations in your palms? Numbness and tingling in your hands and feet are the most telling signs of poor blood circulation. You might also feel something pricking you, like pins and needles. All of these are caused by the restriction in the blood flow. This means a good amount of blood isn't reaching them. As a result, you have numbness and tingling. Number three, swelling. Imagine you have a water fountain. Now, when the water circulation system isn't working properly, what happens? Water collects in certain areas while others remain dry. And of course, your fountain won't be working. Something similar happens to your body when your circulatory system doesn't work. Fluids will accumulate in certain areas of the body, especially the legs, feet, and ankles. Swelling in your lower extremities are a result of poor circulation. There can also be other reasons for swelling as well. Heart failure and blood collection in your lower body can also cause this. Number four, digestive troubles. Do you have problems with digestion? Do you often wonder what you might be eating to cause it? Your poor blood circulation could be behind this. Just like other organs in the body, your digestive systems need healthy blood supply to function at their best. When this doesn't happen, you face digestive issues. Poor blood circulation can lead to fatty matter collecting along the lining of your blood vessels in your abdomen. And guess what that means? You have problems like diarrhea, abdominal pain, 
constipation, and bloody stools. You might even get cramps because of reduced blood flow in the digestive system. Number five, cognitive problems. This one might surprise you. When we talk about poor blood circulation, we think of pain, numbness, and swelling. But brain issues? That's something completely different. Your brain, like all other organs, needs adequate blood supply in order to perform well. When your brain doesn't get enough blood supply, it's unable to function. The lack of oxygen and nutrients can lead to memory loss, difficulty in concentrating, and other cognitive issues. This is why experts say a healthy mind comes from a healthy body. Both are connected. Number six, joint pain and muscle cramps. Your body starts aching when you have poor blood circulation. Your organs aren't getting enough oxygen and they'll let you know this somehow. This is why when you have poor circulation, your arms, hands, legs, and feet start to hurt. You'll also notice how your cold hands and feet start throbbing as soon as you move them. That's because they're warming up and the blood flow is returning. Another pain disrupting your life will be affecting your calf muscles, especially when you've been standing or sitting for long periods of time. This is because your legs aren't getting proper blood supply. And now comes for the more dreaded parts, muscle cramps. They definitely can scare the daylights out of you. I mean, they're just so painful. Muscle cramps and stiffening happen when your oxygen and nutrients aren't reaching your tissues. Is there any more reason to hate bad circulation? Number seven, fatigue. Feeling more tired than usual lately? As if you're feeling exhausted all the time? Maybe you're skipping tasks throughout the day because of your fatigue. It does happen. If you're feeling like this, it's best to review what's happening in your life, especially when it comes to your health. It could be your body's poor circulation affecting your energy levels. When you have poor blood supply in your body, your levels drop because your organs, tissues, and cells aren't getting enough oxygen. Another bad effect is that your heart needs to pump blood harder to make up for the poor circulation. All of this leaves you feeling more tired than usual. Number eight, changes in the skin color. Noticing weird changes in your skin? Confused over why this is happening? Seems like your skin is changing for no real reason. All of this could be due to poor circulation in the body. It can make your skin look blue or pale. This happens because of insufficient blood reaching your tissues and making them appear blue or pale. And in case there's any blood leaking from the capillaries, your skin might even appear purple. You'll find these skin changes mostly around your nose, ears, lips, hands, and feet. Any discoloration of your skin should be mentioned to a health expert. Number nine, leg ulcers. The one thing you should never ignore is a leg ulcer. There's no excuse for delaying a visit to the doctor. Leg ulcers are mostly due to poor circulation, and you need to get it diagnosed in time. But how does poor blood circulation end up in leg ulcers? Well, that happens because your body's poor healing ability when it doesn't have a good and healthy circulatory system. You can get ulcers in your legs and feet. Sometimes the blood in your legs vein can pool up and form ulcers. This will result in swelling beneath the skin. Before we move ahead, here's another video you might like. Number one, blood clot. One of the biggest reasons behind poor circulation is blood clotting. Depending upon their size, blood clots can block the flow. Most blood clots that develop in your legs and arms cause poor blood circulation. Blood clots should never be taken lightly. If one in your leg is able to get to the other parts of your body, it can be very dangerous. It might even cause a stroke if it reaches your heart or brain. They can be deadly. Number two, varicose veins. Ever seen enlarged veins that look like a web of spiders? These are varicose veins and can cause poor blood circulation. Varicose veins are usually found on the back of your legs. These damaged veins won't be able to work as efficiently as others, and this results in reduced blood supply. Number three, obesity. Being overweight increases your risk of getting several diseases, and poor blood circulation is one of them. 
you have a higher chance of developing varicose veins, which lead to poor blood circulation in the body. When you're obese, you need to be extra aware of how long you're sitting or standing at a stretch. These can further contribute to getting circulatory issues. Number four, diabetes. So you thought diabetes only means affecting the sugar levels in your body? Turns out it can also mess up your blood flow. Diabetes can cause pain and cramps in your calves, legs, buttocks, and thighs. Number five, narrowing of blood vessels and arteries. Poor blood circulation can result from diseases that cause narrowing of the blood vessels and arteries. One such disease causes small arteries in your toes and hands to get smaller. This means less space for blood to flow smoothly. As a result, you have reduced or disrupted blood circulation. There's another condition where arteries stiffen up because of plaque buildup. This decreases blood flow. Poor blood circulation shouldn't be taken lightly. Okay, welcome back, welcome back. It has been uh, about six to seven minutes of uh, vital information to you, the listening audience. So I do hope that uh, it was well absorbed and well accepted by you guys uh, that are viewing and listening at this point in time. I probably will play the clip later on so that you can, um, it can bring it home for those of you because sometimes you hear something and it's not yet registered. And I want this information to be registered um, deep down into your psyche so that you will understand sometimes something is taking place with your body. So for, for instance, some of you might be having aches and pain and you just tell yourself a massage is going to be the solution to your problem. Sometimes you need more than a massage. I tend to say it um, from time to time. Sometimes a massage is very, very good. It helps relax the body, relax the muscles, you understand, therefore reducing inflammation in the body and reducing pain. But what if your problem, your achy body is deriving from poor blood circulation? What if? What if there are narrowing in the blood vessels? In this clip, it did not talk about um, deep blood thrombosis. It did not talk about that. But, you know, many of us, you know, might be, I say, I'd like to say us as a people. I like to say us. When I use the word us, I, I'm talking about a people. You understand? Each and every one of you out there. And I do not like to, to separate myself and to think that I'm more um, important or I'm better off than any one of you out there. Because each and every one of us are faced with health challenges from time to time. And what we do when we face those health challenges is very important. Are we going to sit and wonder? Or are we going to wait for someone else to tell us what to do? Or are we going to get up? and find out what is the cause and what is the problem, what is causing this. So, you know, this did not was not mentioned in the video. So some of you might be feeling like your blood is, a, is training and there's a force going through your blood vessels. You know, you may not have varicose veins uh, standing on the outside uh, so that we can see it visual. But what about what you cannot see? What about that pain? What about that, that numbness and that um, pain when the blood is trying to pump, when the heart is, is overworked, trying to pump that blood through your veins that are narrowed or even hardened, become very stiff. So the elasticity in those blood vessels are not functioning properly, right? You know, um, I use very, very small amount, limited supplements at health and wealth lifestyle and one of the things that i do use is um a product called super duper that it helps with rejuvenation from a cellular level so it reactivates your dormant stem cells therefore sending it to the areas which needs repairing in your body and it assists you with that with softening the blood vessels so that you can have a, a better flow of your blood but what about those of you who are having clotting? Your blood is clustering and it's sticking together, sticky cells, we like to call it. What about you? What are you experiencing? What are those symptoms that you're experiencing today that definitely can put your, your life or in, in, in a critical situation where you can have a blood stroke or a bleeding in the brain? Even you can have problems breathing. I remember um, not too long ago, my, my sister-in-law, she had a fell and she broke her foot in three places. And uh, she came out of the hospital and, you know, they were taking care of her. She came, of course, for me to make sure that she doesn't get any infection in the foot while she 
is being treated um, or take um, over what I should say, why she's been under the, the hospital care. I, and one of my observation that I had is that she was breathing different. So based on my experience again, and I saw that individual, I said this breathing is not from nothing that um, happened overnight. It probably came from your, from the a blood clot in the lungs. So she was having problems breathing. So many of you might say, oh gosh, you're just having a problem breathing. It just uh, is an onset. And then you might just sit down and say, okay, it came from, uh, you know, late asthma. So, you know, some, most of us, when we, we get older, you go to the doctor, you have problems breathing, they say, well, it's asthma problem, or there's dust in the air. And we, we make a lot of excuses. But in order to really find out and figure out what the problem is from the root core, getting to the bottom of your situation is coming down at health and wealth lifestyle and getting a proper evaluation done and that is important yes a proper evaluation done we perform the live blood analysis which is so important it can give us information as to how your blood is circulating if it's clustering and sticky of course we are we alert you and these tests is just to alert you and put you on guard it is a preventative measure Yes, it is a preventative measure. For those of you who already have the problem, right? It is existing in you, just waiting for the right moment to manifest in a terrible way, right? Causing you to have a um, blood clot, causing you to have a stroke or even a heart attack, yeah? So there are some things that you can do when you come at health and wealth lifestyle. But when you fig fi figure out what is going on with you, when you figure out where the blood, poor blood circulation is arriving from. Is there any solution? Yes, there is always solution. At Health and Wealth Lifestyle, we take great pride in having some of the most potent and effective products in the planet in the form of supplements. Yes, in the form of supplements so that you can use it to help revitalize and re-energize your body. Right, so that your body can repair from a cellular level. That is what we do at Health and Wealth Lifestyle. We do not want to wait until you have that blood clot so that they can put you on something that is aggressive, that not just help you with your blood clotting, um, causing the blood clot to, to dissolve, but it also causes damage on other organs in your body. Do you want to experience the side effects? In my experience, a lot of people are suffering today, not just from lifestyle diseases, but from problems that was brought on by using medication, prolonged use of medication. And we are seeing people suffering today because of that, because of being over-medicated, because of being on medication for a prolonged period of time. And therefore, now it's difficult to bring that body back to a good state of repair. But I say the number one key thing is to get your circulation running effectively. Now we know the, 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 the purpose of the red blood cells, of course, is to take oxygen and nutrients throughout the entire body. And if your brain is lacking nutrients and oxygen, what is going to happen? You're going to be foggy. You're going to feel dizzy. You're going to be feeling woozy. Yeah. And, and of course, we have one of the best supplement that has over 200 different minerals in it. Right, that was going to help you from feeling woozy and dizzy, but it's going to nourish your body. But we have to get that blood circulating properly. Of course, that supplement has zinc and magnesium, all the Bs, you know, and yes, it is going to assist you. But there are other things that we can do to help improve your blood circulation. And we at Health and Well Lifestyle, we again carry supplements that can be very effective in helping improve your blood circulation yeah you know one of the topics that i love and i enjoy because it is a passion that i have in taking care of persons feet it is a passion you know we 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 offer we offer at health and Wealth lifestyle the ionic foot detox we say foot detox but it's really detoxifying the entire body and that is a very important tool also with detecting persons who have poor blood circulation. 
It also detects persons with digestive issues and many other lifestyle diseases. If you take a look on the screen there, you can, you can see what I'm talking about, right? And this is how it's performed. So for people, for you to think that, okay, a foot detox is a myth. Listen to me. A foot detox, coming down and doing an anic foot detox can help save your life. Because in that, in doing the foot detox, what we can detect is if it is that you have some blood clotting factors in your body, it depends on the color of the water, we can assist you. And it, again, it is a preventative measure. It can prevent you from getting into a critical situation. It can prevent you from having that blood clot because we are able to detect the factors. We are able to de detect the ingredients that will lead up to a blood clot in you. And that's just by doing our anic for detox. Remember, we will ask persons to do not think that an anic for detox is also a, a foot soak. It is not. We do, we can do foot soak, yeah? But if you're talking about detoxifying the body, if you're talking about detecting lifestyle diseases, an foot detox is something that you must do and you should do. It also is followed by a soothing foot massage. And who doesn't want a soothing foot massage? Tell me, who doesn't want a soothing foot massage, which of course is going to help relax the body? But doing a foot detox, don't just walk in a space and do a foot detox and think it's okay. Because again, it can give us vital information which can save your life. Yes? And we are on the topic of blood circulation, right? Some of you are experiencing darkness in your feet. Now, the video talk about discoloration, blueness, what we will experience because the darker your skin is, is the, um, you're going to see different color. The lighter your skin is, you're going to see it more bluish than blackish. The darker you are, you're going to see it more black. So it depends on the color of your skin. You're going to see the discoloration coming out of there. So pay particular attention. For those of you, when you look at the palm of your hands, it gives us a story. So sometimes persons come and, and I can, just by looking at the hands, you have problems. I can tell if you have poor blood circulation, if the blood is not getting into those extremities, if it's not getting in your fingers, just by looking at your hands, dear, we can detect. Someone who have experience can detect. Now, this is not a matter of, of trying to get money out of you, but it's trying to get information for you so that you can improve your health and you can improve your life. And that is what is very, very important, right? I'd, I'd say to my staff at Health and Wealth Lifestyle, Health and Wealth Lifestyle is no Health and Wealth Lifestyle without the result that we get from each client that comes in into our space. We pride ourselves in getting results. We pride ourselves in giving proper and accurate information so that your health can be improved on a daily basis. Some of you may be more chronic than others. So some of you have to see us more longer. Some of you have to see us more often. So do not look at another person and say, okay, this helped them. And I'm going to use this and hope it helps me too. Now, at Health and Wealth Lifestyle, what we do, that's why we have these various um, equipment, various tests that we would perform so that we can find out what's taking place with you on an individual basis not looking at someone else and say, okay, you have same symptoms. You may have similar symptoms, but your situation may be different. So that's why you would need to come in and get a complete evaluation so that we can see what's going on with you internally and we can make accurate inf um, recommendation that will be suited for you, the individual that will be doing the test. So, may, you know, sometimes we have husband and wife come in into establishment and one will be doing a proper evaluation. Now the other will ask, can I use this too? Of course, I'm gonna say, yes, you can use it too. But what we need to do is to get your information to know if this will be the best course for you or this will be the best supplement for you or this program will be best fitted or suited for you as an individual. So this is why 
we are health and wealth lifestyle. We do have husband and wife package where you get discount. But when we are having discounted prices, it's the, you know we have it across the board. But we do have special offer where husband and wife can come in. We have special discount for young ones, anybody under 18. We do have special discount for the elderly. We have discount based on you, the individual, how old or how young you are. So we advise you to pick up the phone and call and make that appointment now. Call and make that appointment. That num those numbers are one eight six eight two seven five eight three five nine two seven five eight three five nine or two eight eight one one zero eight two eight eight one one zero eight call and make your appointment today so that we can place you in a in a position where you can have information and not just information but solution to your problem so call us now remember we are on air now i do have my staff there so you can do what i always ask you to do you can call allow the phone to ring a couple of times and then you can hang up and i will return the call in the shortest time possible okay so do not take this to be lightly some of you experiencing tingling and you can feel like pins and needles maybe sticking you in your feet your fingers you need to be at number 73 eastern main road in barataria let's do that complete evaluation that's a one time spending money until we're ready to do a, another evaluation to see how your body has responded to the treatment so this is a one time situation over the next few months you spend your money you get a complete evaluation right you get the information and then we hand you solutions to the problems that you might be facing a lot of people i remember some years ago i were doing some treatment on an individual where she had an ulcer she was diabetic she came straight out of the hospital with a very very bad infection in the foot and we did try to save that foot one of the things that we were able to accomplish through the treatment is to bring that individual blood sugar at a level standard that individual will no longer depended on any medication any insulin any any um whatever blood sugar medication there is out there they were free from using that medication. But one of the things we were not able, because of the short space of time and because of the critical um, condition of the individu individual, we were not able to get that blood circulating properly. And from that day, I started to pay very, very close attention to blood circulation, to having proper blood circulation, right? So, yes. So I, I, you know, and from that day, I, I vowed that I have to get person's blood circulating properly. If we don't, we will be spinning top in mud. You could take how much detox you want. You could take four or five detox yearly. You could use supplements. And some of you may be using some kind of supplement and you're not feeling the effect. You're not feeling energized. You're not feeling right. You're still in aches and pains. It's because the ineffectiveness of getting your blood to circulate properly. So I will say again, we at Health and Wealth Lifestyle do have solutions for you, okay, where we can help clean up your blood vessels, we can help your um, soften the blood vessels, and we can help you to eradicate blood clotting. It's a program that I would ask when you get on it, if it's necessary for you, that you stick to the program as tight as possible, and that is how effective your result is going to be. So call us and book your appointment today. Remember, even if you are out in Tobago, many times my Tobago clients ask me, are you coming to Tobago? When are you coming to Tobago? When I have news for you, anybody outside of Trinidad and Tobago, what you can do, you can call us because we do have a unique device in which we can use even where you are, where you are sitting hundreds of miles away where you are sitting miles away, we can get that done. Okay, so you can call and you can book your appointment now where we can we can do a scanning of your entire body, right? And this is effective, it's scientifically proven to work 
it has been used by the U.S. Army. So what I'm saying is that call us and book your appointment today. Call us and book your appointment for today. Some of you, you know, you can download Cash App, and that's the way you can get cash to us. And, of course, we will get vital information to you. All you require is an email, and we can get that information to you. And, of course, we will make a recommendation because we do have associates back in, in various um, parts of um, the world. We do have some associates. So I hope that where you are, we can get that. Um, we can get supplements to you. We can post it via the, the mail. So do not sit at home and think that there is no help for you because I'm far away from Trinidad, okay? You can receive help even where you're sitting today. Some of you are sitting in your home and you say it's difficult to, to move yourself from home. Some of you are bedridden and you want help. Um, your loved one is saying it's difficult to get from, from point A to point B. All you need to do is to pick up the phone and allow us to know, yes, we do some home visits, but sometimes it's difficult for us to leave the establishment to do those home visits. It takes the entire day. And, of course, we have other customers that will, um, of course, need our attention. So call us at 275-8359, 275-8359, or 288-1108. Call and book your appointment today so that we can do that complete evaluation to see what's taking place with you internally so that we can help you with your poor blood circulation. Of course, I want to talk about ulcers when I come back. I'm going to go for a short break. And of course, coming out of the break, I want to do the, I want to play the clip so that you can get a better understanding what you missed earlier on. You're not going to miss it now. So pay close attention. Stay locked on. Do not move from in front of that radio. Do not move from in front of your, your Facebook right stay put because the information that you're about to listen again can save your life or the life of a loved one call allow the phone to ring a couple of times and then hang up and i will return your call in the shortest time possible the effectiveness of getting results and of course making recommendation that is best suited for you as an individual stay locked on we'll be right back Hey there, viewers. Your circulatory system is working 24-7 to keep you going. The slightest problems cause reduced blood supply, oxygen, and nutrients. It isn't something you should take lightly. In today's video, we'll be discussing symptoms and causes of poor blood circulation. Besides cold hands and feet, what else could be causing poor blood supply? Fatigue, joint pain, digestive problems? What about the causes for the reduced blood flow? Do obesity and diabetes affect your blood supply? We'll be talking all of this and more. Let's discuss. Symptoms. Number one, cold hands and feet. Do people always tell you how cold your hands are? Do you feel your hands and feet are colder than the rest of your body? It's a screaming sign of poor blood supply. But what does blood circulation have to do with cold hands and feet? Well, it turns out a lot. When blood in your body is not flowing at a healthy rate, it leads to temperature drops in the skin. These temperature fluctuations affect the nerve endings in your hands and feet. That's why they're always cold. Speaking of cold hands, how well do you handle winters? Which season do you love the most? Share your preferences with the Bestie community in the comments below. Number two, numbness and tingling. Do you ever feel numbness in your feet or tingling sensations in your palms? Numbness and tingling in your hands and feet are the most telling signs of poor blood circulation. You might also feel something pricking you, like pins and needles. All of these are caused by the restriction in the blood flow. This means a good amount of blood isn't reaching them. As a result, you have numbness and tingling. Number three, swelling. Imagine you have a water fountain. Now, when the water circulation system isn't working properly, what happens? Water collects in certain areas while others remain dry. And of course, your fountain won't be working. Something similar happens to your body when your circulatory system doesn't work. Fluids will accumulate in certain areas of the body, especially the legs, feet, and ankles. Swelling in your lower extremities are a result of poor circulation. There can also be other reasons for swelling as well. 
Heart failure and blood collection in your lower body can also cause this. Number 4. Digestive Troubles Do you have problems with digestion? Do you often wonder what you might... Yes, so I'm sorry that we had to cut that um, that, that video short, but of course we're going to continue on the discussion of um, poor blood circulation and the various um, methods in which we have at Health and Wealth Lifestyle to improve your blood circulation so that you can be a healthier you and a more productive you. Remember again, you can call us at 275-8359 to book your appointment today, and yes, we can, we can have uh, your appointment booked in various parts of the country and even out of Trinidad and Tobago. So call us today, 1-866-275-8359 to book your appointment today. And of course, we have Dr. Sarah here with us. And of course, it's a very short space of time. We just have about, uh, about 10 minutes, maybe 10 minutes mm -hmm. left into the program. Dr. Sarah, welcome to our program again, Dr. Sarah. Thank you, thank you. Good morning to the listening audience of Trinidad and Tobago. Um, Yes, yeah, so I heard that we are talking about circulation and from a traditional Chinese point of view that um, acupuncture is one of the best means of allowing the blood to flash through the system very freely and it's one of the best modality in terms of allowing proper blood flow in all the extremities because when, when you have problems with blood not flowing it don't go down into the extremities so you get a lot of numbness you get a lot of what people say like pins and needles in their hands and it's because there are blockage that happens inside of your system and acupuncture tends to open up that meridians and allow the blood and chi and everything to flow so you get relief from those issues that you're having so yeah um one of your one of the most chronic point of not getting proper health is having a poor circular system and circulation is one of the key criteria in allowing the body to come back into its national into its national natural, natural. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. And, and 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 Dr. Sarah well said, well said. It couldn't be said better by myself. Of course, for those of you who are suffering at this point in time, there are various methods in which we use at Health and Wet Lifestyle to help improve your blood circulation. Of course, Dr. Sarah, you know, we do deep tissue massage, just, but I don't like to say deep tissue massage because we look from it from a medical point of view in a holistic way as to how you can approach persons who are suffering with aching body, aching parts, various parts of their body. Sometimes they're experiencing aches in their head, um, in their neck. But I've seen you, Dr. Sarah, when you perform and you do the massage, mm -hmm. I love to watch you work where you can even, you, 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 you massage the airs, you know, getting to that point where you can release the or touching certain points in the body, I should say, touching certain points in the body to allow that blood to flow properly. And now, Dr. Sarah, we, I hear you clearly when you say acupuncture can allow the blood to flow properly. But what about persons? I know we do do acupuncture and we also do supplementation where we get various herbs and stuff like that to use to help like clean up the blood vessels and of course to help us soften the blood vessels because in some cases the blood vessels are very thick. It's very hard, very mm -hmm. stiff. So the elasticity when the blood to, to, um, to expand, where I contract and expand, mm -hmm. it's, it's limited. So what other um, methods we can use coming from your point of view to improve person's blood circulation? All right, so acupuncture is one modality. There's also cupping. Cupping is excellent for mm -hmm. people who are afraid of needles. So we can use cupping as part of the therapy. Mm -hmm. um, there's also, a, we use a technique called gua sha. It's an ancient technique where you scrape the body at certain points Mm -hmm. to get the blood flowing depending on what is the issue so we can use different modality and of course internal medicine is part of the treatment sometimes a body is so depleted that you can't go and interfere with it you have to 
give it the right nourishment, you have to give it the right medicine in order for that body to be come back into a flowing stream, as they say, for the energy to flow, for blood to flow. So there's different methods that you use. It all depends on the person condition, depends on the individual that come before me that I can take. Um, I want to stress this, and I know it's time for mm -hmm. so I kind of mm -hmm. speed enough saying what I have to mm -hmm. say that 90% of what I notice is because most of the client that I see is elderly patients. Mm -hmm. And 90% of the issue coming from blood sedation is because of the medication. There's a lot of side effects. But that I happen, did mention that. That happened with it. So, I did mention that, um, Dr. Siva. That's, mm -hmm. So it's kind of contractive in mm -hmm. trying to deal with somebody that is taking something that what side effect is actually certain numbness. And that is it. You're Swelling. treating something mm -hmm. that is creating something. So it becomes very challenging. Difficult. Yes. Very challenging. So mm -hmm. with, in that sense, I, I wanted to point that out because it makes it difficult. So now the best way to deal with somebody like that is trying to wean them out of the medication in order for their body to become adaptable to heal on its own. Mm -hmm. But it becomes very, very challenging, as you say, mm -hmm. because they are on it so long and it's so many complications. So um, I just wanted to point out that. So when mm -hmm. you're coming, put that to the back of your mind that you have you have to deal with this from a really, really patient point. You can't just want it overnight. You're going to see progress, but it, it takes time and it takes your diligent effort in wanting to work in your own speedy recovery. Okay. So I know time is running out. <laughs> yes, so yes, time is that. running <laughs> out. We um, just have about a couple of minutes. But I, what I want to um, also add to that, Dr. Sarah, um, persons do get results. But yeah. what you find, people very, very impatient with the progress that they're getting. But if it is that you're in a chronic state and you come here that that you cannot find out what's taking place with you, you run several tests, you spend a lot of money, you got it free from, from our healthcare system, and uh, you know, you're not getting any improvement. And when you come at Health and Wealth Lifestyle and you start to see improvement, you're expecting a click of the finger. But the very first day, you're definitely going to feel different, whether it's through, through supplementation or whether whether it be through acupuncture or any one of our therapy that we offer at Health and Wealth Lifestyle, improvement is a must. So I want you to be patient and also scientifically it has been proven that it takes 9 to 18 months for uh, with proper nutrients and proper supplementation that the body will repair in that time. But we at Health and Wealth Lifestyle, of course, we speed up the progress because we have our best supplements on the planet at Health and Wealth Lifestyle, which we offer and which we recommend to you, the public. And of course, it's through herbs and through tablet and liquid form. So you can call us and find out about those supplements that we offer. But I would say, before you try to put something in your mouth, let's do a complete evaluation, which will assess you, the individual, and we will put a program together that is best fitted and best suited for you as an individual, so that you and your, your health can start improving almost immediately and i say you and your health yeah because once you hear you feel different you will you will start to respond differently and you know you will see the world differently you can many people cry and say oh gosh i want to die i'm fed up with aches and pain you know you cry many many times many nights but we at health and health lifestyle say stop crying stop complaining the place to be is number 73 eastern main road in barataria and if you cannot come call us at 275-8359 to book your appointment today. Call us. And remember, at Health and Wealth Lifestyle, we also have our healthy bread. That bread was designed particularly for the persons of Health and Wealth Lifestyle who may be having issues, lifestyle issues, such as diabetes, high blood pressure, high blood sugar, and it also helps improve your digestive system, your circulatory system. So everything we offer at Health and Wealth Lifestyle is to improve you for, in a holistic way improve you from a cellular level so don't be too late sometimes people come when it's too late do not sit down and procrastinate and say i have to come i have to come and you don't show up call and book that appointment today and i'm asking you to keep that appointment because that appointment can help improve your life right it can help improve your life how long should one live one should live as long as they desire but of course, living and the state that you're living in is a different problem. If it is that you desire to live pain-free and you desire to spend the rest of your days on the planet in comfort and in peace, you understand, adequate nutrients, the place to be is number 73, Eastern Main Road in Barataria. So let's stop suffering. 
call us and book that appointment today, 275-8359. Again, 275-8359. 275-8359 or 288-110. Call, make your appointment, call and order your bread so we can have it for you on Saturday, hot and fresh, so that you can put it in the refrigerator so you can have healthy bread to eat during the course of the day. So I'm looking forward for those of you who make your appointment for Ionic for detox, your live blood analysis, your acupuncture session. We deal with health in a holistic way at Health and Wealth Lifestyle. Remember, as we always say, from Health and Wealth Lifestyle, your health is your wealth, and prevention is always better than medication. Thank you for viewing. At Health and Wealth Lifestyle, we offer a wide range of services, blood analysis, iridology, acupuncture, foot detox, foot massages, gua sha, hot stone therapy, fire therapy, legs and feet massage therapy, mineral scrubs, acro therapy, cupping. We also have a wide variety of supplements, silver, zinc and magnesium, body light and lots more. We at Health and Wealth Lifestyle operate our business in a clean, safe and comfortable environment. We frequently sanitize our compound and abide by all the COVID guidelines that are currently in place. So come on down to Health and Wealth Lifestyle where we treat you like family. Book your appointment today. Call us at 1-868-275-8359 or 1-868-288-1108 and remember your, your health is your wealth and, and prevention is always better, better than medication. At Health and Wealth Lifestyle, we offer a wide range of services. with us is a very simple song. Whoa. 